Well, you might remember the story about a boy who survived a powerful lightning strike. Some say it had to be a miracle. Yeah, and now, six years later, that boy has had another chance encounter with fate. CBS 21's Jason Bristol live in the studio tonight. And Jason, is this story living proof that lightning can strike twice? I think so. This was a pretty big story back in 2004. And tonight, we're going to help you put two and two together. What's it add up to? How about something remarkable? Over the course of a Friday night football game, lightning can strike at any time. And for Ethan Martin, his time came against Mannheim Central. Less than four minutes to go, his team down by three. Ethan, number 81, blitzes and knocks the ball away. I didn't hear a whistle. And I saw the ball bounce around, so I just picked it up and I ran with it. 65 yards for the touchdown. The instinctive play, he went after the quarterback. Uh, Missed him at first and didn't give up on it. The game of football is fast, but it can be broken down Hi. into action and reaction. At one point, though, Ethan Martin didn't have much of a reaction to anything. Ethan was only 11 years old then. He was going to this Costco with his mother and brother. The weather was really bad. After he left the car, he headed toward that entrance. Unfortunately, he never made it. His mom, Mary, later told CBS 21 News what had happened. So I went over and rolled him over and he was bleeding, but then he had his eyes were rolled back in his head and that's when I knew that it had to be lightning. That's right, lightning. It kills one person a year on average in Pennsylvania, according to the National Weather Service. A Costco employee and a shopper helped perform CPR on Ethan and then he was rushed to a hospital. Ethan was in danger of becoming a statistic. One of the physicians um, came in and said, we do have a steady heartbeat. And I remember my very first thought was, uh, so what do I have left? No one was sure either. Sure Ethan certainly looks like a little boy in this on. video. But for a long time, his parents say he didn't act like one. He was tired, seemed depressed, reacted to things like he was in a fog. And it's understandable why. A typical lightning bolt is two to four inches wide, two miles long, and travels 20,000 miles an hour. And that kind of electrical force somehow found this 11-year-old. This is the hat I was wearing when I got struck. You see that hole? Now you understand why Ethan is lucky to be alive. We don't call it luck, we call it God. <laughs> you know, God saved Ethan's life that day. Ethan doesn't remember that day at all. After a year or so, he was back to being Ethan again. And now, he has a life full of football, friends and family, more than enough to fill a senior scrapbook. And he also has that Phillies cap. To look back at the hat and know that it actually happened because I have no memory of it is kind of just, like, leaves me in awe. It's probably changed us more than him, you know, as far as being thankful and not taking anything for granted. I think about it sometimes, but, I mean, since I'm still here, I'm just going to keep living my life like the best I can. So. And he has so well. In fact, you could say he's actually experienced a strike of lightning twice. And fortunately, Ethan's senior season isn't over yet. Lampeter Strasburg has a district playoff game tomorrow night against Big Spring. Guys? Amazing. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and you're talking about how he felt right after it happened. I mean, something like this is so sudden. Could it have been some type of uh, post-traumatic stress disorder? Uh, his parents believe so. Uh, his mother told me a story she recalls always trying to keep an eye on Ethan because he would just wander away, and mm -hmm. they always had to keep a close eye on him. But now you look at him, he's big, he's strong, mm -hmm. and he hopes to play college football, of course, when he goes to college. So he is uh, certainly a remarkable young man, and mm -hmm. what a story. He's and got what it a kid. together. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Lightning does. strikes twice, once in a bad way, yes. and then once, once in a, really in a good, good way. way. Yes. We're rooting for him. Yes. All right, Jason, thank you. Certainly uh, has been very beautiful weather lately.